You're now rocking with the best Luminary Sounds, the number one station for independent artists. So that's what's up. So what we got going on next? Well, okay, I have some something kind of funny. I don't know, kind of funny, something sad, and some, sad. Yeah. Okay. It's gossip, you guys. So it's actually it's true, but okay. So you know Donald Trump is um oh my hosting gosh. something tonight. You guys heard he's hosting something tonight, right? Yes. He's I, doing commentary no. on a fight tonight. What? He, he's the comment he's doing commentary on the fight. Yeah, on the um Ho- Holyfield and Belfort fight is him and Donald Trump Jr. he's going to be com- and he's getting he's getting paid lots and lots of money. I heard it was a lot of money he's getting paid. Millions of dollars. Who gave the okay for that? Um. Well, he did. Obviously, I, I mean. What is he throwing the fight? No, but to be honest, the p- promoters or whoever put this on are really smart because a lot of people are gonna tune in to watch this. I, I'm would be no. if we weren't going to the night market, I'd be super interested just hearing <laughs> what he'd have to say because it's like live yeah, and yeah, uncensored. Yeah. Like, there's gonna be so many memes tomorrow of what him and his son say. It's gonna be ridiculous. Yeah, um, he's already yeah. saying stuff that's crazy. He he called out Biden. <laughs> like he called out the. Would he want to fight the man in the ring? They said, yeah. He said, oh if he could fight anybody, it would. No, who do you who do you think will win? Uh, it if, doesn't matter. I know, but it's just fun, right? Who do you, who do you think will win in, in a in a charity boxing? I'm not even gonna say. It's it's for charity. No. No. We no, all you still lose. Can't. We <laughs> all lose if we're seeing two presidents fight like a reality TV we show. I mean, it's all, it's like we're a step away from that, literally. So you mean like, we're, we're just on the edge. We might go there. I hope we don't. <laughs> Nobody, I just don't think anybody wants to see two. I, I agree. Elderly, let's not play games here. They are elderly men in the ring. That's so sad. <laughs> it is. It's awful, you guys. <laughs> it's so sad. It really is. But man, it would, the numbers, if, no, I'm just I, obviously it's, it's ridiculous. <laughs> the whole world would watch. It's ridiculous, right? But I'm just saying. Do you know the pay per view numbers will be out through it's the roof? Outrageous. Yeah. Through the roof. That's crazy. So what kind of what? How many millions of dollars would be okay for this for this fight to happen? Would it be like morally okay to watch this fight? Will it be morally okay to watch it? I mean, is it morally okay to live under the conditions with the president? I mean, I, we have to live under their decisions. <laughs> I mean. Just to get them to a little tussle, that ain't nothing. We watch mm. that every day. No. I mean, like, but I'm saying if they were to make... T- it would have t- to be charity. $500 million. If they made $500 million and they didn't take any money and then they said, okay, we're going to actually use this money to pay off I, I, I would be some all, of our I would, debt I'd or pay off the health care. I don't hey, know. Hey, man, like a, a five-bound get-it-on match, right, with what? 50 ounce gloves they so nobody would not gets make hurt it five rounds <laughs> well that's what i'm saying that's why i'm well three let's do three they rounds wouldn't, they wouldn't make it past one i know but the, the money that they would that they could generate from this would be massive it would be bigger than ali ali and what's his name uh Thriller in the Manila, whatever. I don't know. I can't remember what it's. Oh my god! It would Joe be the Frazier. biggest fight Joe, in the whole world. Joe, it would be Joe Frazier in, in history. Than, uh, It'd be bigger George than George Foreman. Yeah, everything combined. P- Pacquiao Mayweather. It'd be on every. TV it would be the biggest the thing ever. Yes. It would be the biggest yes. thing ever. And then what? And then are we gonna have the leaders of the different countries box each no, other? We t- no, we take right. that money. Is that where we're gonna go next? United we t- Nations. Just well, we take like, the money. We feed the homeless. Right. We give to. We give to mm. charities. We give to a uh, uh, man. It would be such a good thing. I'm kind of all for it, though. It seems like you got I, this whole rollout plan for that. I got this rollout because I mean, <laughs> there's so much money that could generate from this fictional, never will happen bout. <laughs> but man, the money would be so great for the with, money. Yeah, it would be great for the people that are in need. How do we know, like, back in history, that there weren't any presidents that ever? Squared up. Or they they sh- may have. I mean, I'm George, sure Washington George Washington got it on. War. I'm the first president. We gonna do yeah. it out. Yeah. Thomas Jefferson. You know, I, it was those oh, was man, the beginning steps. I'm sure you know what I mean. Can like, you imagine? I'm about story. to take this wig off and let's get it on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm to, let's go. They would do duels, you guys. I don't think that they would <laughs> fight box oh, each other. Ten paces. They would do the ten pace <laughs> duels. <laughs> At the at the oh dawn my of goodness. light. At, at the dawn of light, meet me here. <laughs> Ten paces and turn around. Yeah. Oh man, it's hilarious. Okay. So sorry, I, I, sorry. I just think, but okay. So to top this topic off, though, I just think 
this fight and the previous president's commentary comes on the 20th anniversary of 9-11. Could you think of something better to do with your time other than be silly on a, a TV show? And, and I know that's what he did previously, but it's like do something else on this day. Don't try to make millions and millions of dollars off of this fight where you're going to be controversial and you know it. All the things that kind of it's just bringing in money. That's all it is. around it's this today. Right, right. It's just kind of odd. Kind of odd. Yeah. 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 Well, I know that the... Pre so, President Joe Biden, he is planning to visit a few different 9-11 memorial sites uh, to commemorate the attacks. Yeah, so I was watching this morning. he's not going to be doing no fighting. I was watching this fighting. morning, and George Bush had a um, a, a beautiful speech See, this previous morning. presidents beautiful doing... Beautiful speech, yeah. Great probably his like that. probably right, his right, best right. yeah I mean yeah we just joking right about the raising it's all really about raising the money That's, no I know no no, yeah, no I know yeah. no 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 but I understand what you're saying like at, in these times we need I, I don't know maybe it's a bad decision to do the the boxing uh, commentary on 9/11. Uh, uh, I don't know because to me he did that on purpose uh, I have to admit something. Um, there's a lot of things happening on September 11th going on right now, but yeah. I kind of feel like should we be doing things on this day? Yeah, I it's think, something yeah. I've always thought about. Like, I think it's kind of low key disrespectful. That's that's what I'm saying. Like, you know, <laughs> there's a lot. I did. I have thought about it before. Like, should I really be going out and enjoying things? What I, in my opinion, September 11th should just be a day of just reverence where you just. That's just what I think. Am I, I wrong? We just I, had a holiday. Should we continue Monday, to move on you know and, and not move on, but go with our lives? I think that nobody's celebrating the day. I think that's disrespectful. But I do think that it's good to still move on with your lives. I mean, isn't that what a part of this whole thing the last 20 years has been about is fighting for the American freedom? And so... Everyone, all these soldiers have been fighting so that way we have um, freedom to have a nice Saturday and and enjoy the sun. You know, I don't think it's disrespectful. Uh, OK, I like how you put that out there. I mean, I think people would uh, for me, if I was in that tragedy, I would want people to live their lives. Yeah, so I, I would. I definitely yeah. would. Um, anyway. It's not like it's not like, I, and nobody's forgetting. It's not like oh, we're never gonna forget. It's, we it's always like, remember. Yeah, you can't even think of September without thinking of the eleventh. You know, exactly. so it's not like we're letting history forget it. That's true. That's true. That's true. So you want to get into another uh, music review, another trending yes. topic? What you got? Let's do a music. Okay, review. so we're gonna listen to I think it's Black Odyssey Funkentology. Ooh. We're gonna sip to you, light it up. Mm -hmm. 